testing out the um, tutorial that we're gonna do. So like, this is a sneak peek tip. You want plump, fuller lips. So you don't even need eyeliner really. You just lip liner. Oh yeah, lip liner. You just. But sometimes you can use black eyeliner to line your lips. It's fine. But today we're just gonna. You, you just want to make it look like it's really plump. Look, look how plump. You don't even need plumpers. You don't need any lip liner. Like the lipstick does it all. The lipstick is wonderful. Okay, it works. Look at me. Like I just I look beautiful. I look great. So now another sneak, sneak peek tip is like a illuminator highlighter. As you can see, I already highlighted and concealed underneath my eyes. I also did like a five inch winged eyeliner that makes you look more like Asian, like you have no eyes. Sometimes you wanna like make people think, like you wanna like be a mystery. So we're gonna take this broke down highlighter. We're just gonna highlight, you know, <laughs> things that need to be highlighted, like the bottom of your cheeks. I don't know why you would wanna highlight that, but we're gonna do that anyway. And like the middle of your nose, you wanna highlight that, but but you know. Okay, that looks good. And you're gonna highlight the top of your you don't and perfection is not key here. You just basically go with whatever your finger is telling you to do. Look, I look amazing already. Now for the eyebrows, and there's no order, you just do like any old order that you want to do. So you don't have to do your foundation first, you don't have to do you do anything. You can do one mas like look, I'm gonna do one mascara. Like I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do like one eye. Like you don't wanna like you wanna you know, I don't know. You don't need it to look anything special. You wanna like scrape it at the bottom of your eyes so you could kinda get like an effect like look like this. You wanna do this? So it looks like you have more eyelashes. That's like a that's like a tip. Look, now you look like I have so many lashes. You don't even need fake lashes when you have this. Look at this. It looks great, right? I'm gonna come back to the other eye later. So today I'm gonna show you how to achieve this look, this hair and everything. My hair just like, oh, but you know you don't even need to tease it. Just, okay. So this look is just for like a simple daytime look. If you're running to go to the grocery store, where else can you be going? Walgreens. You can even wear this on a quick date, you know, a quick date or whatever. Walgreens, hanging out with your friends, going to get ice cream. Like this is a simple daily look, and I'm gonna show you how to achieve it on my little cousin. Okay, so we're gonna start. Can you can you see? Are you seeing? I think you're seeing. Okay, so we're gonna just start by her hair. We'll fix the hair later, but basically you don't want to have like like this. This whole thing is not about perfection. It's just about what. Like what? What would you feel at the moment? So like, cause that's always like the best, the best thing, right? When you just, when you just don't plan anything, you know. <laughs> so we're gonna start with eyebrows. Oh, and there's no order of how to do your makeup. You just whatever you feel. You start. So her eyebrows are already a little bit thick. So we're just gonna fill it in. We're just gonna fill it in, and you wanna drag the eyebrows down. Why are you? <laughs> You don't want to take it all the way down to like the corner because then you're not going to be able to, it's going to take away from her eye. You just kind of want to accentuate it a little bit. Okay. Okay, so now you don't even need that gel stuff that people put on their eyebrows. Like, I don't put it, I really just. You literally can just use mascara to smooth down the hairs. So you just follow it. And it's perfect because mascara is a wand. So you can just follow it. The darker, <laughs> the darker the better because it like shows your eyes a lot. Like it really, really brings your eyes out. See? And like, I am so beautiful. Yeah. Look, she already looks totally different and it looks really nice. It's good. Okay, let me see if you're in the camera. Well, yeah, you are. You are in it. Okay. So now we're just going to start with concealer. <clears throat> we're 
we are going to, the lighter the concealer, the better. You don't ever want to match your skin, ever. So we're just gonna dab like a couple. And then we're gonna like, you know, under your eyes. That's really a big deal, big, big deal. Big tickle. Okay, so right now, you think she looks a mess. Honestly, you don't even need to really blend anything in. You just like, The thicker, the better. You want a cake. You want to cake your face. Like look at look at my concealer. Like you wanna, you just wanna cake it. Like you don't even really wanna. You tr really don't wanna blend it. Like you really don't. You just kind of wanna pat it on, pat it on. You want it to look like it's not even your skin color. Like, it's not even your birthday. Just you know. Okay. And that's not even the last of the concealer. We're gonna add another layer after we actually finish. Look. Doesn't even look like her skin color. She looks great, amazing. Now we're gonna add foundation that is not even her color. You see this totally different color. And we're just going to put a drop. Right now. And you just wanna make sure that you don't even blend it out. You want it to look Maybe this is her skin color. Maybe this is her skin color, but you know what? It's okay. Okay. And it is my skin color. Well, it blended in fine. That's okay. It's not good, but. Whatever. We're going to. Whatever. We're going to contour her nose now. You know, Asians. Like, look at the contouring on my nose. So, we're going to start by using a light brown. You're going to go from the top all the way to the bottom. This is just basically like the base contour. We want to add a darker shade, so we're going to take an even darker brown. And you're just going to work your way around the nose, like so. You start up here and go down and then around the little tail of her nose. You see? Very nice, slim. Don't blend it at all. Don't blend it. Just leave it. Leave it. All right. Now we're going to put this eyeshadow on her. This is um. It doesn't matter what it is. Use whatever you see. You're just gonna draw it on pretty much. Cause you know it's a pencil. It's a pencil. You just like you're writing on paper. Like you're writing on a face. Yeah. You don't blend in anything. You just. Draw, just draw it. That's it, you leave it like that. And then we're gonna put some winged eyeliner. And you wanna make sure that the winged eyeliner is like five inches out. You don't want any type of shape, you just want it to be all the way out. Like that. You want also you wanna make sure that you have two wings. Not not one, two. See? Come closer. A little bit. See it? Two wings. Okay. Draw it out. This is actually really good liquid eyeliner. Draw two wings. They don't need to be the same. You see, like, when it's not the same, <clears throat> you, you look so unique. You look unique. Like, no one's going to be able to have this on their face. We're just going to accentuate the creases. So you just put it at the corner where the crease is. You see? Perfect. It's fine. Simple, just go to the corner, go out, it's perfect. Okay, let me see. You look fabulous. Okay, so now we're going to do mascara. Mascara, you don't need any of that fake lashes, none of that. You just simply put it on. I'll show you a tip. Look at the tip. I'll show you a tip to how to make your mascara actually look like. There's more to it. So, you basically, when you're doing the bottom of your mascara, you're going to actually put some underneath your eyes, like this. You're going to do this. See? So that it actually looks fuller. I'm going to do this.
so that it actually looks like fuller mascara. She almost looks like an anime, like a character out of anime. I'm actually going to make her eyes a lot more bigger. So because I don't have a white eyeliner, I'm going to substitute by using a chunk of light eyeshadow. And I'm just going to fill that in in the corner of her eye. <coughs> <laughs> the powder got in her mouth, it's fine. It tastes fine. wonderful. I'm just gonna do that. Okay. She's almost looking like the black swan. Kind of, almost. Oh, okay, so you're gonna put this in the center too. Yeah. <laughs> you look great! You look great, you look great. You look great. Okay, so like, you wanna um, highlight? <clears throat> highlight? The eyebrow bone, whatever. <laughs> we don't need terms. We, you really don't need terms at all. Don't use this. So for me. now we are just gonna add some blush because she's looking a little bit pale. She's going to rosin up her cheeks. Smile. Actually, don't smile. You don't even. You don't. You don't need to know. Look, it's getting everywhere. It's getting everywhere. It's even on her arm. Look, it's just. Oh my god, this is amazing. Oh my gosh, it's like fairy dust. It's like fairy dust on a summer oh night. God, don't it. Fairy dust on a summer night. Look at that. I can go on a date. Yeah. Are so many guys going to want me with this? Yeah. Look, I know guys are watching this video right now. You want this. Wait till I do her lips. Wait till I do her lips. We're going to contour the face now. Contour brush, bronzer, doesn't even matter what color. If you have black, that's sorry. Sorry about that. Ran out of batteries. You know, making all these YouTube videos all the time, tutorials for everybody that's requesting them. Took up a lot of our battery, but it's fine because we love what we do. We love making you look beautiful. We want you guys to find boyfriends. Okay. All right, so we're still on lips, right? Let me finish that up for you. Okay, so this is the third lip color. Remember, I told you there's three. You're gonna try to make it like really big lips, really big lips. Everything is bigger for our makeup sort of. Bigger is better. Yeah, you're gonna outline her actual lips. <laughs> I know you probably think she looks like a clown, but she doesn't. <clears throat> All right, now you're gonna put this powder, this is finishing powder. This is finishing powder. And what you do is you close your eyes. This is gonna help the makeup stay on all day. You know, all day. All day long. All right, let's take a look. If you don't want your lips to be this big, you can keep them like mine, just go a little bit outside of the lip line. If you don't want your winged eyeliner to be that long, you can do it like mine, really fat, really fat. And this is pretty much the look that we're trying to achieve. When you're doing your hair, you don't really do it at all. You roll out of bed and whatever it looks like, that's fine, it looks great. See like this piece, she actually, curled a little bit of it like one she curled like she just curled like one strand it's fine and you just leave the rest and you know it adds like more volume <laughs> definition so yeah if you would like us to do any more tutorials just request if you want us to show you maybe a slower version of how we did this one or um, what else just hit us up on our Facebooks, you'll know it's us because we do the same makeup all the time. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed it and send us some pictures if you try it out yourself. Okay, so that was like the stupidest video. Can I see it? No, it's like recording. It's recording. So we pretty much showed everybody how they could achieve this look. And I hope everybody likes it.